Hey, I'm Jeremy with Kajabi, and I'm gonna show you how to set up a podcast. And just like the rest of the tools on the Kajabi platform, you don't have to be tech savvy to unlock this knowledge product. Before I get started, be sure to subscribe to the Kajabi channel. That way you won't miss any value-packed videos on how to build a thriving online business. And if you're on YouTube, click that alert button to get updates when new videos drop. A podcast is a fantastic opportunity to market your business, grow an audience, and earn revenue. They're such a powerful tool that has ascended in popularity, moving from just 11% of the US population listening to podcasts in 2006 to 55% in 2020. That's why every Kajabi membership comes with the ability to host and syndicate a podcast to the top audio streaming services, all within the Kajabi dashboard. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can start and build your podcast on Kajabi. Oh, and stick around until the very end for a special offer. Kajabi podcasts allow you to distribute your podcast to Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, and Spotify. Once you're ready to build your podcast in Kajabi, you'll navigate to podcasts under the product section. Step one is to choose which type of podcast. There are public and there are private podcasts. We'll start with the public podcast. In step two, you'll add the name of the podcast, who hosts it, and a description. This is what gets sent to the actual RSS feeds that end up on Google, Apple, and Spotify. You'll also upload your podcast image. Everything in the podcast industry is based off of album art in a square format or a one-to-one -one ratio. We recommend a 3000 by 3000 pixel file. These are big images, but they can end up on big desktop screens. So for brand awareness, we suggest the highest pixel density image that you can get. Once that's uploaded, you're going to click continue. In step three, you'll add the public owner email and the language. The public owner email is used to verify ownership of the podcast, and it's the address that will show up on your podcast directories. As for language options, there are dozens of languages supported across different podcast platforms. Then you must select at least one podcast category, but you can choose up to three if you'd like. Finally, decide whether or not you want to list your podcast episodes from newest to oldest or oldest to newest, split up by season. If you upload your episodes individually on a set schedule, you may want to choose episodic from newest to oldest so that listeners can easily access the latest episode. After that, you can click create podcast. And just like that, Kajabi will generate it. From there, you'll see a podcast overview with more customization options, such as preventing downloads, marking content as explicit, and page customization options as well. Now you're ready to create your first episode. You'll enter an episode title and type, either an episode, bonus, or trailer. You can add it to a season if you wish, and you'll also create a detailed description that will be visible on your page and the various listening apps. Then you're ready to upload your episode. The maximum file size is 250 megabytes, and we support an MP3 format. After you've uploaded the episode, you still need to take action and schedule it. Just click back into the episode where you can make any additional adjustments, like adding in a transcript. And when you're ready to schedule, on the right-hand side, click Schedule and select the day and time from the calendar. Also keep in mind that the time zone defaults to whichever one you're currently in. After you've published, you can go back into the episode to copy the link, which will direct the visitor to where the episode is hosted on your webpage. For public podcasts, you need to syndicate the podcast with the various directory or listening services. So from the podcast page where you can see the list of episodes, click distribution. Each directory has their own process to approve and list each incoming podcast. We have information and links that you can access by clicking learn how. For example, with Apple Podcasts, you need to create or sign into an Apple Podcast Connect account. We provide the podcast's RSS feed URL at the top with a copy button so you can easily copy and paste it into the field when you provide it for each service. When they approve, the directories will give you a URL that you then paste into the field. Then the podcast will connect and become available to listeners on those platforms. Once your podcast is syndicated to Apple, Google, and Spotify, people will be able to listen to your podcast in a couple different places. First, they can listen to your episodes on your website on the public podcast feed page that is automatically generated when you create a podcast. This page includes information about your podcast in addition to links out to the platforms where your visitors can listen, as well as every episode that you've published so they can listen right there. If someone is on a mobile device, when they click on one of your platform logos, it will open the Podcasts app on their phone. 
Kajabi also allows you to offer a premium podcast, which you can directly monetize and sell with offers in Kajabi. To create one, you can go back to the Create Podcast Setup menu and select Private Podcast. Just like with public podcasts, you'll need to add a title, a description, and a thumbnail image. Then you'll choose the language, category, and episode order. Where it differs is that instead of distributing the podcast to listening services, you'll use Kajabi offers to grant listeners access to the podcast. You can attach the private podcast to any of your existing offers, or you can create a new offer, choose the private podcast as the product, and select a price. You can edit this information like you would any other offer on Kajabi. For private podcasts, in the podcast overview page, you can see how many subscribers you have and that it's tagged as private. You'll upload episodes the same way that you would with a public podcast. Private podcasts are locked behind the login portal for your customers who have purchased it. You can also choose to grant the offer to existing customers. When you do that, it generates a specific RSS feed URL with an authorization token just for that customer. That way, they can still access your private podcast via the podcasts app on their phone. You can gate the content, but still let your customers enjoy the content within their preferred podcast directory. What's great about podcasts in Kajabi is that you'll also get podcast analytics built right in. You can choose to look at all the data points for the full podcast or for individual episodes. To view the full podcast analytics, click the analytics button from the podcast overview. To check out how an individual episode is performing, click into it from your list of episodes and then click the analytics button. You can see the number of downloads, the apps used to access the podcast, the devices, device operating system, and the countries where listeners are located. You'll also see your top 10 episodes by downloads and links to get more data from each listening service. Now you've seen how simple Kajabi makes it to create, host, and distribute a profitable podcast. Beyond giving you the ability to easily create and manage your podcast, Kajabi includes the tools and the services you need to take it a step further and build a thriving online business all in one place. Kajabi provides a website builder with customizable themes, hosting for video and audio courses, assessments, a member community, email marketing, contact management, automations, analytics, and much more. It's a comprehensive suite of tools to help you manage your knowledge commerce business. It's also easier and usually less expensive than stringing together multiple tools. And because you've watched this demo until the end, I wanna share with you a special offer that we've created for our YouTube viewers. If you sign up for a free trial through the link in the description, not only will you get a 14-day free trial of Kajabi, you'll also get additional training materials from online business experts. So click the link in the description to claim your free trial offer and get actionable expert advice you can start applying today. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel if you want more videos like this in your feed and be sure to put any questions or feedback you have below in the comments. Thank you.